What's goody? What's goody? Tinha presebo. Oh, Mr. Jab. He said, Night was biting off ears. Pay attention. Being afraid to trying to kill you. Nah, nah, nah. That, 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 yeah, that, 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 that's what they do is they give you a sparring person that. Allows you to feel like you're playing against Frasier. Skills. I still have two days. You're gonna rest. 
I knew it. We're gonna We're gonna rest the rest of the way. We're gonna rest. He said, chill, no, no, no biting. Yeah, man, you know what time it is, man. I think I'm gonna redo the story after a couple of fights. I've been trying to get this Mike Tyson build to, to, to Hall of Fame for the longest. I, I, I'm like only on boxer or something like that. And we welcome you to Vegas, where they do it bigger and better than any other city when it comes to the big time fights. We're at the I already got all three belts. Center home to this championship fight 12 rounds of heavyweight each man comes into this fight supremely confident expecting to deliver yeah, a double Tyson, yeah. Mike Tyson's making his way to the ring now and he looks very focused for this fight Morris's self-confidence seems to just come through with each step he takes man, down the ring heavier They should make another, they should make a real, a real Rocky game and let you like battle your way up to the top, you know what I'm saying, fight all his fighters, play, play with Drago, like, you know what I'm saying? He gonna come out aggressive. Oh, and he is southpaw. The opening round of 12 scheduled for tonight's bout. Jab him. First, we gonna jab him a little bit. We gonna jab him a little bit. Jab him. Just a little bit. Jab him just a little bit. Yeah, and I think the anticipation in the air is twofold. One is, are they gonna see another knockout? The other is, what happens if he hits his opponent and he's still there? Got him. Iron Mike with a big uppercut. Got him. With the overhand Got him. Oh, oh my good. goodness. Goodness. That left over killed them, dogs. Yes, the Rocky story mode would be crazy. So now the question becomes after that knockdown, and he has gotten up, how does he survive? So one of the ways he survives is if he's been taught. Have good Got him. Habits. Have good That's Tyson up and cut crazy. There. You're going to find out right now. He needs to right now. That is Got a him. classic Tyson uppercut. Halfway through round number one. Nice work to the midsection with the left. Another huge shot comes in early on in this fight from him. Well, he understood that his opponent, Joe, was a slow starter. He's jumping right on him, taking advantage. Uppercut. Ooh. Looking uppercut that time. Ooh. Tyson's at his best Ooh. when the combinations are landing. He scored well there with that combo. Got him. Chopping Got him. Oh, he's in trouble. Oh, and now the real My Tyson's too strong, man. I rebuilt him. He's too strong, man. Too strong. He ain't getting up. He's done. It's over. The Get him out of here. Is over. Tyson's done it. How about that? A first round knockout victory. Let's go. Now we're gonna go, Joe Frazier. Tyson is still heavyweight champion of the world. Tyson. For I'm Joe Tessitore. You see how Thanks accurate I am with Hope these you shots? The broadcast. That's like I know I know a few of y'all got the Xbox. Y'all guys gotta get the y'all guys gotta put this game on, man. I'm gonna hit up brute. See look, I'm at champion. I ain't even at superstar hall of fame, nothing. Damn.
Schedule fight. Next one is Joe Frazier. Oh, no, it's not. I'll take on Tommy. Let's go, Tommy. Let's go to the streets of Detroit. Let's go. Let's go. Tommy gonna come with the heat. I know Tommy coming with the heat, so I'm gonna have to come at Tommy with the body shots to soften this man up. Woo! Woo! I ain't never knocked down my sporting partner ever. Woo! 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 Counter punch is crazy. Oh! Oh! I'm giving them wreck bums a break, man. I'm giving them a break. I'm going to let them get some wins, man. Because if, if I go in there, you know it's going to be a wrap. It's going to be a wrap. We're going to rest this day. We're going we gonna to rest. See, this is my, this is my edited Tyson. Look. Boxer Grove. See? My jab is eh. I'm still a 70, a 79 overall. Like my jab is eh. Eh. I could put up, I got 4,000. I could put up something straight jab. See, but as you can see, my hooks, I already maxed out my hooks. Uh, the upper, the uppercuts are a little up there. See, I could put this up right now. Body jabs, I don't really go for body jabs. Hooks to the body. Combinations, I could, see, I could put that up right now. Um, head movement. Let me, let, let, me, let me put that up for sure. My chin. Uh, my heart. Um... I'm 
I'm putting my combination out. Nah, I ain't never tried that that Creed joint. Facts. It's going down anywhere, anytime, dogs. Anywhere. Anywhere, anytime. We gonna rest. Let's go get Tommy. Let's go get Tommy. Now they just all fighting me for my belts. Now they just coming so after Joe, me. That's what it so is. Glad you're with us, Joe Tessitore, alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to the MGM Grand here on the Vegas Strip in beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada. A much anticipated rematch in our main event, and these fans are really looking forward to it. Scheduled for 12 rounds among heavyweights between Mike Tyson and Tommy Morrison. Mike cool. Tyson coming down to the ring now. Iron. What a nice reception. Mike Tyson. He is completely mm. focused in on his goal tonight. Morrison's approaching the ring now. And this ring walk can tell you so much. Look at the focus on his face. Yeah, this guy, he, he's taller than me. He got strength, he got power. So I'm gonna have to play this one right. Y'all might see me get knocked down. I haven't played this game in a minute, but y'all might see me get knocked down right now. It's all right, but we, we're gonna be all right. We're gonna make it. In the middle corner, by 29 wins. 29 knockouts. We went over the rules in the dressing room. Let's have a good, clean fight. Touch them up. Opening round here, scheduled for 12. Tyson's feeling pressure. And he has to be feeling the pressure because all the talk all week has been about the knockout streak. He's won every fight by knockout. Well, there's been a little other talk, too. They've been talking about how the national anthem is usually longer than his fights. <laughs> ain't stupid. A I ain't well stupid. Placed left hand up top. I ain't stupid. You're going to soften you up a and little bit. Tyson with a block punch. Once you start throwing Hail Marys, then we'll start taking advantage. You're still throwing baby Eddie, shit right now. What advice did you consistently give to a fast fighter in a situation like this? A speed fighter when he was fighting a guy ah. close to him. Put yourself in position where you can use that speed, where you can control things. The dimensions you want. Stay on the outside. Be able to use that range. Thanks, stupid. Make the guy walk to you. Make the yeah. guy burn up. You don't jab, you don't jab. that punch. Very good defense by Mike. I ain't stupid, Tommy. You ain't getting crazy yet. You ain't getting aggressive. I ain't dumb. Nah, we ain't dumb. I ain't stupid, Tommy. Get away. Oh, now you retreating. Hey. He gives as well as he takes. Good. Hey, let's go for him. More get off me, get off me. Come on, come on, come on. The way he's doing it right now, he's holding on. He's got him. Left hand comes oh, the rope safe. Bro, come on, man. Get off of me. Left, get him off of me. Got him. There he lands the right hand well. Bro. Got him. Oh, this is going to be close. He may be able to survive. Straight jazz. Bang. Get up. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I don't like when he do that, man. That's cheating. Rising up after being knocked down. All right, you got the second round. That's cool. Can you believe that? 
He was saved by the bell. Teddy, you've been in a spot like this before as a trainer. Right now, you know what? What do you spend time on? You want to spend time on telling him why he got in that spot, why he got hit. Hey, but yo. first, you got to make sure he revives. Hey, yo. You got to get him clear-minded. You got to get his senses back. Hey, right. yo. Hey, sexy Jason lady. Come. Nice it to was come, nice right? to know you. Feel? He's counterpunching. You need to be aware Girl, of that, okay? you want to come to my Watch hotel? Maybe I leave you my ring key. I'm feeling the way you carry yourself, girl. And I wanna get with you, cause you're the cutie. Let's go. Morrison's corner. Now he's getting aggressive. Yep. Now, now. You can tell now. That he's a yeah. That's what I was waiting for. Stop clinching. In the last round. Get aggressive. Good right yeah. Hand. Up one. Got him. See, certain, certain people, we gotta, we gotta wait for them to start getting aggressive on them big haymakers, because that's how you hit them. Being a counter puncher, crazy. One, Get up. Two, three, four, Morrison's climb back up from the canvas may inspire him. Nice work, Tyson with the hook. Oh, now he's throwing jabs again. No more haymakers? Oh, okay, no more haymakers. The Thought he had his target, goes. but way off to the side with the uppercut. Got him. Focus, focus. Tyson uppercut. Oh, he just... And bang, away he goes. Well, he's been there hey. before, and now he's there again. He got, got him. More. He can't afford to keep going I hit him with that Tyson jaw. I don't the referee's going to step in now and stop this. Yeah, I'm trying to get him tired. He's done. He's done, though. Look at this. He's done, though. Tyson's in prime form. Power surge here. Knockout. He's done, though. That man, done, though. Tyson. Eighty-one percent. Partner Teddy Atlas. This is headshots. Saying thanks for being body here. shots. I'm telling y'all, man. Yes, yeah, pro. What else? Let's do pro. Go. Whatever. Let's go. He caught you with one there, huh? It's okay. It happens. This is boxing, after all. It doesn't matter that you got knocked down. You can get him back in the next round. You did the right thing, though. You took your time and you got back up. Your father would be proud of you. That's what champions do, Andre. They get back up. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Son, that rep ain't gonna do shit but count somebody out, which means you got to knock that cracker on his ass. Yeah. And you got one round. Knock the fucker on his ass. Knock the fucker on his ass.
position is better though. Body shot. Up and forth, go up, downstairs, downstairs. Up, up, downstairs. Oh, I'm getting tired, I'm getting tired. Uh, I'm just he, he in the ready. Ha! Got him! Try to headbutt me, you mother. Come on. Body shot. Oh! Jabs is quick though. Let's go. Knock him. Let's go. Congratulations on your victory, boy. You look real good out there. We're really fucking impressed. Haters. Welcome to the real world, baby! <laughs> Nighty night, bitch. I don't want to die in prison. Yeah, they only got it on the eggs. Easy, easy now, I wish I'm everybody had this game so I could whoop Stay all of you out. You're lucky they left you breathing. I wasn't always this lucky. This Cuban is no amateur. He could have turned pro years ago. He's been the amateur champ for nine years. Nine years, are you gonna let him make it 10? That's right, that's why we're here, to get the gold medal. Now go get him, kid. So we start round number one of Andre Bishop against the sensational Cuban Joel Savone. You know, I heard a lot of experts ringside. Already tired? How? About the lack of experience for Bishop compared to Savone. Of course, Savone's a nine-time champion, and you have to wonder and ask yourself: Will the nerves of Andre Bishop start to get to him? Will he be rattled against such a worthy opponent? Joel Savone's left, working well that time. Good flush. That's a tough Damn. moment for Andre Bishop right now. He's Damn. hurt. I can. Oh, and there Damn. you go. On the mark. Beautiful. Play this game in a minute. Punch right on the mark. Like an arrow, and not shot by Cupid. Yo, what up? What up? Yeah, this game is fun. This game is fun. I haven't played this game in a minute. I gotta get used to it again. See, I'm used to Hard playing to with my Tyson. For a situation like this, but many do. He's been down, now he's got to survive. So that's where you're wrong. It's not hard to prepare, it's a must to prepare. If you're a trainer, that's what you do in the gym. You teach a guy, if you're in this situation, this is what you do. You grab on, you move your head, you survive. Little head knocking with Get that off right me. hand. Oh, okay, you felt that power, huh? He returned fire right there, and it worked. After being rocked, now he gets his man. At this point, it's not about the skills and the abilities of these two fighters. It's about the dreams of them. And one of them is being eliminated. Got him. Ooh. Teddy, when a southpaw faces an orthodox fighter, he has some natural advantages. But Got him. one of them just comes from the fight that the righty doesn't see a lot of lefties, right? Well, that's Got exactly him. right. He doesn't have much time to practice against the southpaw. So it doesn't feel comfortable. It doesn't feel comfortable before you know it. You're not doing things that you should be doing. Andre Bishop getting to his opponent's head. Nice job by Bishop with the power shot. 
Joel Savone's getting himself him. into the mix now, landing that left hand. Jeez. Well, in a time of need, you turn to your closest allies. Andre Bishop coming off of that round where he was knocked out. <laughs> Get knocked out like your old man used to. Yeah, time man. To hear the truth, My hands already oh, hurt. Time My hands to already hurt, truth, yeah. He knows he will get that from his Try to get some cushion for these damn remote controls, man. Trial, You're only giving me one shot at a time. You've got to string your punches together. Now, listen. This is what you got to do. Keep your hands up. Don't worry now. I just need you to focus. Keep your hands up and keep working like... They gotta come up with a new boxing Breathe game too, man. Deep. Breathe through your mouth. We gotta get off in there, okay? We gotta let those hands go. We gotta pick it up. Bishop's hope is for him to be steady on his feet and just survive at this point. Remember, that last round, he was down and nearly out. Well, his hope is that his corner revived him during that minute rest. And also, they gave him good advice because the most important thing is don't let what happened the last round happen again. Correct what you did wrong. Andre Bishop is struggling to keep Joel Savone at bay. You can see he is scoring a lot of points. Andre Bishop's not firing off the big power punches. I got to wonder why. Sometimes a guy is making a solid agreement in his mind that maybe if I don't hit him hard, he won't hit me hard back. He's not confident enough now to throw the punches without worrying about what to come back at him. Good flush, straight left hand. He got hit right there, but he also gave one. Solid effort got by him. Andre Bishop. Wow, got him. what an uppercut. He Get off flinches me. Don't hold when he gets me. to the inside. He's showing what a skilled fighter he is with the counter punching. Well, the old times used to say when you calm in there, when you're controlling there, you can make him do what you want. He made him tie his shoelaces right there. On the mark with the straight left hand. Oh, Got what him. a power punch he was able to land there. So that's what you call setting up a trap. Not a mouse trap, but a punch. That is a big How? Trap. Bishop is Sway. on shaky legs. And you know what's gonna hurt him now, Joe? He's such a cocky fighter, such an offensive minded fighter. There it is! This is going to take Come some on, shots to get man. up on this. Once again, he goes down. Man. So now the question becomes, after that knockdown, and he has gotten up, how does he survive? So this is where instincts kick in. You got to start moving that head automatically right now. You don't want to stay in the middle. Good block there by Andre Bishop. Damn. And we come to the end of the round. He it's a sticky bumping, move. It ain't as right easy now. as it look, though. Winning this fight. It ain't as easy oh, as it look. Nice one. Bishop's searching for something different as this round. Starts. How about that left right? Oh there? my big shot there. Andre Whoa. Bishop is on the receiving end of a power shot that scores a knockdown. Down, but not out. Bishop gets up on his feet. Right now, what he has to do is he has to kill a little bit of time. He's got to move his head. He's got to be defensive-minded, clear those cobwebs a little bit, then think about winning the round later. Hey, hands up! Solid shot, the overhand left. Andre Bishop's inability to get away from his opponent's left hand is so evident. And it's going to stay that way if he doesn't change something. He needs to move the other direction, away from that punch. That is a big right hand after eating one himself. An accurate left by Andre Bishop. Doubles up the jab. jab. The it seems to me that Bishop is right now uncomfortable with the pace that's being set in this fight. Well, he started the pace. See, that's the funny thing about it. He said it, but he might not be able to keep it up. by Andre Bishop. <laughs> Savone's able to land a nice Got clean him. left hand. <laughs> Scored 
well up top. Got him. I'm trying to go for night night shots. I got to. I'm, I'm down too much. This night has not gone the way the trainer Gus Carisi night night thought it would go. Uh, Andre Bishop has dug himself crazy. a big hole here, and we're in the late going. Well, a good trainer always has to be part. It's of different when I'm playing with Tyson, man. Tyson is different. Right now, he has no couch to put him Got on. Got him. Oh, he is stunned. He could go down. Oh, what a big oh. shot! How about oh. that? He goes from being the victim to hey. the punishment. Hey. See what I'm saying? I had to go for them haymakers. I had to go for them haymakers, B. He he, he, he was up, up too much. That punch, put him down on the canvas. Now he needs to get on that bicycle get him. and stay away from this guy. Get off now me. Just wasting away some time with that clinch. Got him. Got him. Got him. Savone's left, landing well. Bishop's going a little bit of a defensive shell, but Teddy, I'm seeing punches still getting through and splitting that guard. Yeah, well, that's the problem, Joe, when you put those got him. on, but you don't move your head. Some of them are going to get through, and just as they're going to got him on the ropes. Got him. So your opponent got him. Got him. Got him. Told you. Got him on the ropes. Down for a second jab, time. jab. Got him with that jab, baby. This time to rise up and continue on. Let's go. Was expecting this you want some knee punk? Huh. No. What, what are you doing in my head messing with these people? The knockout victory Let's go. Over Joel Savone. Bishop is your gold medalist here at these I'm World Amateur story games. in a minute. Let's go. Andre, how does it feel to be named fighter of the games? It's terrific, honestly. Being voted fighter of yeah, the games. Yeah, baby. It's an honor. <laughs> gold medal, baby. Yeah. Uh, this is my baby brother, my big baby brother, Randy. Hey, big baby Bishop, I'm a fighter too, and one day I'm gonna be right where he is now. <laughs> like I was saying, it's a lot of talented boxers out here, and it's an honor hey, just being... Hey, Bishop brothers are in the house, big baby Bishop, what? what? It was a fabulous tournament. <laughs> Truly exciting to watch. But even more exciting, McQueen Promotions is pleased to announce that we've just added Isaac Frost to our roster of boxing talent. Isaac, are you disappointed that Andre Bishop won Fighter of the Games? Disappointed? <laughs> I'm the heavyweight gold medalist. No one went the distance with me. Nobody here could ever go the distance with me. I am the best fighter at these games. Period. Andre Bishop is a talented middleweight, but I, I think uh, Isaac makes a good point. Regardless, both these young men could have very bright futures in professional boxing. That's how I climb back and beat the, 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 the dude, kid. the first one. You got your father's power. He certainly does. His father hit like a heavyweight, too. <laughs> Gus, <laughs> despite our differences, I've always said you're one of the best trainers in the business. I don't care what you say about me, Queen. <laughs> Always nice to see you, Megan. Always nice to see you, too, Gus. I'm bringing my daughter into the business. You know how good she is with fighters. I want her to manage Andre. You're a great trainer. Why not concentrate on what you do best and let Megan and I concentrate on Andre's career? Thanks, but I think I can handle it. 
Isaac Frost will be fighting for a title within two years. I can do that for you, too. Thanks, but I can handle it. Did this old man ever get your father a title shot? He was on his way! The only way to the title is through me! Not if nobody can beat me. Oh, you think so? You don't know who you're fucking with. Dad! You've been listening to this stupid old man! Dad! You don't know who you're fucking with! I apologize. I forgot that it was that, no that thorough. But your father, on the other hand, he chews fighters up and he spits them out. Gus, if we just... Megan, you're a good egg. But no way are we getting in bed with D.L. McQueen. I respect your decision. Lucius Palmer likes to run, but he'll get aggressive at the end of each round. He's good at stealing fights. Good luck, huh? Thanks, Megan. She's right about Palmer. She's a smart girl, that Megan. Good evening, everybody. I'm Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas. We have a big card for you tonight, and a lot of people excited about what we're going to bring you in moments on our undercard. It is the pro debut of the middleweight, Andre Bishop. He will be going up against right, the KG veteran, Lucius Palmer, from here Let's at the Aragon Ballroom in Chicago. Stay with us for that. Come on. Everybody in this arena has been looking forward to this moment. The opening moments of Andre Bishop's pro career. So much hype, so many expectations. Stands opposite Lucius Palmer right now. Run, of course, all that hype built on Get the off. foundation of a gold medal at the World Amateur Games. Come on. Good defensive skill. Come on, you Shelton. Scores up top with a left. Come on, down to the bottom, up, up top. Teddy, I find it unrealistic that this guy's got much of a chance you against run, this power puncher. <laughs> hey, that doesn't make you You gotta no fight up and under, bang. I'm gonna tag you, dogs. he's acting like a fighter. Coming What's back that? with the right hand Get off. after getting Get scored off. upon. Staying away from those headshots with his defense up top. Got him. Andre Bishop got has him. always had a knack for that. I love the way Get Andre will Get look for that uppercut and then deliver it. 90 seconds to go here in this round. That's a good job by Bishop offensively. Landing Bottom. his combinations is the key to victory tonight. Good solid shots with the combo downstairs. And we expect a high work rate among these two fighters. Now, do you want to see that same work rate Get throughout the whole fight? Do you, or is that your expectation? I'd love to because we'd be having a good time and our fans, they're going to enjoy it. Palmer's putting forth that hard work he did. Got him. Charging with that right hand. Come in. Where are you going? Look at that. I ain't letting you run, dogs. One and he's already down. And if he survives here, Joe, you Who wonder knows? how that's going to affect him for the rest of the night. Because we expect him to be aggressive. Will he be tentative from now on? I could look into it, sure, why not? So he goes down, but able to get up to his feet. Teddy, what should he be thinking about now? Well, right now, just survive. Oh, now he coming at me. He survives, then he better figure oh, he ain't wasting time no more, huh? On the floor. Let's come get the smoke then. Final 10 seconds of round number one. And Make no mistake, young man. Oh! Oh! That was an interesting first round for Andre Bishop, the American making his pro debut here. Teddy, Lucius Palmer's the kind of guy that could give a young up-and-comer like Bishop some issues. He likes to steal the end parts of a round, kind of like Ray Leonard did against Marvin Hagar. Has to be careful for that. A headshot block. I'm not going to sit here and try to Palmer's have me chase you. The jab, and when that's not there, 
Oh, you're gonna dug yourself a big hole. Oh, no, that's like saying I want to go swimming. Guess what? Guess what? He is not in good shape. He could be big, big Got shot. Him. He just scored with. Ain't gonna and steal no rounds here, buddy. Again, he goes down. The question Ain't gonna steal no rounds in the end he here, buddy. Rise up again. Not here. And done. Andre Bishop proves to everyone why there is so much hype to the start of his pro career. A knockout win against the veteran. Back here in the Friday Night Fight Studios, I'm Brian Kenny. Amateur gold medalist Andre Bishop taking his first steps as a pro this past weekend on the undercard at the Aragon Ballroom in Chicago. Bishop beating former welterweight contender Lucius Palmer en route to his first pro win. Now, we've seen Palmer before here on ESPN. He's a veteran, he's no joke, and Bishop is now considered to be one of the best prospects boxing has seen in decades. By beating a fighter the caliber of Palmer in his pro debut, no less, he definitely made a statement. Andre Bishop clearly a fighter to watch. In other news, heavyweight prospect Isaac Frost scoring the second knockout of his pro career, beating another overmatched opponent on the undercard of a McQueen pay-per-view in Las Vegas. He's now 2-0 with two KOs. Okay. All right, let's see. Oh, I hate this. I don't believe in building a record fight with nobody. You don't want anything against guys like that except how to make mistakes. We ain't here to do anything stupid. This ain't the amateur. You got a chance to do something great. To be someone great. And I'm going to help you get there. Take some fights against yeah. decent guys. And I want you to show me that you got what it takes. Because if you can stop these guys, I'm going to be impressed. But if you can't at least put them on the canvas, I'm going to be disappointed. Got a kid? I want to see these guys on the floor. The time has come. All the talk is done. Exactly. Now the fight is set to begin. There's Andre Bishop That's in the locker up, room, man. Teddy, with you. his longtime trainer, Gus Carisi. <clears throat> of course, Appreciate Gus was one back, who man. very Real early talk. on tapped Andre Bishop as a fighter to watch. He said he was full of potential. Yes, he was a tremendous amateur. He won the World Championship Tournament. From the State Palace Theater here in New Orleans, we welcome you to our middleweight main event. A much anticipated bout between Andre Bishop and Mike Walker. And Andre Bishop like keep all that momentum. Good all evening, time. everybody. I'm Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas. We're here to answer that question for you at the State Palace Theater in big. New Orleans, Louisiana. Coming off his pro debut win against Lucius Palmer, now Bishop moves forward against Mike Walker. Wow, no doubt about it. Affected by that right hand. Uppercuts. So we want to do uppercuts. It's too big for me to play the games with you, dogs. Of those punches just put him down. Too big. They got their quicker, Pause. No diddy. His hands no got diddy. back to cover. That's a fight, two, man. Yes, sir. Three, four, he went down from a big shot. Now he's got to have some big guts to move along. You're going to find out exactly what he's made of. Bishop's defense is paying off now. The other day when we were talking to Andre Bishop, he said to have success in this fight, I have to land combinations. He landed a good one there. Teddy, what do you look for early on when you're analyzing a fight of two power? Oh, a big shot comes That combo was crazy. Can he get up from there? Hi. He's hi. 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 I just did what the coach now. told me to do, man. That's it. Man, he was good. Was good. He was good. He. One, two, three, four, five. He's done. He's done. Dunzo. Yeah, the uppercut was crazy. I was on my way, and baby brother was making his mark as an amateur. Gus had been our father's trainer. He took right. us in after our parents died. Good. Keep that jab going.
<laughs> he said he's done, son. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. He ain't done till I make sure he's sleeping. Ladies and gentlemen, at two and zero, the young upstart Andre Bishop is getting a lot of attention, and he has hours tonight. I'm Joe Tessitore, alongside Teddy Atlas. We welcome you to this night of boxing here at the State Palace Theater in New Orleans. Bishop looks to start his pro career three and zero as he takes on Wilfred Rosario. And he's a across the way. Yeah, they gotta make a new boxing game like that. Undisputed on, on the PC, that was tough. How you don't put it on, on, on the PlayStation or the X? Everybody's been waiting for these two to meet up. Now they do. Got him. Oh, I missed that. I missed that. Got that one, though. Got that one, though. Count is crazy. We are underway here, and we've heard from him. Oh, he is wow! Woo. Woo. Right to the head hey. and right hey. to the canvas. Hey, hey, hey! Oh. One more time. One more time. Hmm. One more time. Man. Yeah. One, two, three, four, if y'all guys have boxing, if y'all guys have the Xbox and have the game, let's go. Bang. Wow. Legs look shaky. He Get off me. Hurt. Get off me. Scoring with the solid. And he crashes to the canvas once again. Uppercut. I love He's that combo. Before. What about Jab. this time? Ha. That's some real tights in this right there. This is the Xbox. This is only on the Xbox. I, I think I the game is already discontinued. You have to already yeah, have it, but I think it's, if not, if not, it's ending this year. If you got Xbox, go and get the game, y'all. Oh not! Oh yeah, the, the, this is the uh, the 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 S. My father told me to find out. This is what the Xbox to S. To your mind about working with us. It's easy. Yeah. Yeah. All you gotta do is change Gus's mind. What's that all? <laughs> you don't have a say in this. Sure I do. I say Gus is my manager. And I guess I'm gonna have to. He's ever 360. Now. Nah, 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 nah. See, cause I think this is for 360. Thanks. But you could play all oh, the by Xbox the way, games. I was by Keyshawn Hayes camp the other day. His trainer thinks you're a sucker for the left hook. Keyshawn says he's dropping you with it. Yeah. Well, Keyshawn Hayes entitled his own opinion, isn't he? Watch out for the left hook, okay? Okay. Let's go. Watch out for the left hook. Let's go. One of the best looking middleweight prospects in some time now takes a challenge in Atlantic City. Good evening, everybody. I'm Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas. Andre Bishop now 3 0, taking on the heavy handed. No, nah, but if you start, but if you have the Xbox Series X or S, you can still get the game. And I can still whoop you out. If that guy's ready, if that guy's really want to smoke. I'm gonna hit a brutal series, cause I know Brutal got the Xbox too. Alright, fellas. Let's have a good clean fight. Touch him up and let's go. This guy's got a mean left hook. He's gonna try and catch you with it early. Yeah, I heard about that. Mean left hook. I got one too. Oh, he is absolutely. I got one too, dogs. You, it, 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 it ain't that. It, it ain't that mean. It ain't that mean. I got the mean left hook too. What you mean? Oh. What you mean? Get up. Get up. I got the left hook too. So he is 
able to get up to his feet after that knockdown. But, Teddy, it's what's ahead that's the problem. Yeah, we're getting a peek right now into his heart, into his soul. Scores Ooh. well to the head with the right hand. Protecting his head well with his guard. Not there, sir. And Bishop is rocked by a left hook by Hayes. Got him. Here's a moment here as you see the step back counter punch where you realize this is the sweet Get science, not just some raw savagery swinging out there. Look at the little subtleties here, Joe. What he does is he forces him into a position to stop the punch. Not there. And then when he stops, steps back, makes a miss, and comes right back. Got him. Got him. So that left Talk hook. to me about this matchup from a defensive got side. Him. Oh, that uppercut got him badly. Goes up Where you going? Get right off hand. me. Get off me. That's a good job by Bishop offensive. Oh, Stop playing with me. That uppercut is crazy. Down again. Will Stop he get up me. from this? Yo, what's good? He was good. He goes. Oh, I hear you, man. Congratulations on that for sure. So Andre Bishop comes to Atlantic City and hits the jackpot. A knockout win against Keyshawn Hayes. Mm -hmm. Bishop. Brian Kenny back here in our Friday Night Fight studios. We have an update on the career of rising star Andre Bishop. And while he certainly hasn't taken an easy road so far in his career, Bishop is poised to have his coming out party against top 15 middleweight contender Ricardo Alvarez. Something virtually unheard of for a prospect with so few pro fights. What's more, the fight will take Ricky place in Ricardo. Alvarez's hometown of Chicago. Although we can't expect a few fans to make the trip from Philly. Here we go, not him again. What can I do for you, Mr. McQueen? Andre, I have to tell you something about your father. Before he died, he and I agreed to a deal. I was going to get him a title shot and let Gus stay on as his manager. Sadly, he never got a chance to tell Gus about it. I'll give you the same deal. Keep Gus as your trainer and manager. I'll promote your fights. Megan's young. She's got other fighters. And think about your brother. What about my brother? Raymond's got talent. Not your kind of talent, but <laughs> he's big. You see how big he is? He could be heavyweight champ someday. Isaac Frost looks unbeatable now. Ah, who knows? Be smart, Andre. Let me take you and Raymond to the top. Look, Mr. McQueen, I don't appreciate you talking about my father or trying to get me to go behind Gus's back. Stay away from my brother and stay away from me. Are we clear? What's up? You have no idea who you're fucking with, kid. Oh, good luck with Alvarez. I got a feeling it's not going to be your night. Uh-oh. I forgot this story. He said I have a feeling he's not going to what? Good evening, everybody. Joe Tessitore and Teddy Atlas welcoming you to the Aragon Ballroom here in Chicago, Illinois, for a much-anticipated main event. Ricardo Alvarez is an established contender. Andre Bishop is a hot-rising prospect. Have a good, clean Will Bishop shine in the spotlight? Well, everything he's done throughout his career, from the amateurs to this moment now, has prepared him for this moment. He aggressive. Let's go, Mr. Aggressive. Come on. So we're underway here, round number one. Such a distinct advantage as to who the faster guy is, Teddy, who's got, got the him. speed. Hey, How does the opponent have to deal coming. with that? Let's well, go. it's not just the hand speed, it's the foot speed. And as far as that goes, I think the opponent needs to cut the ring down a little bit. You know, be like a linebacker in football. Don't follow him around, but just move parallel. Shrink that ring. Got him. Got him. Step back counter punch there. Nice strike after catching one by Andre Bishop. Of yo, he's dirty, yo. He keep on hitting me my balls. Four. 
Reaching the halfway mark of this round. Got him. He gets away from one and then brings it home with his own. Got him. Got him. Got him. Stop running. Throw it. I think Bishop scored really well there. He just got damaged you. his opponent with that power Throw shot it. upstairs. Throw it. Oh, Bishop got oh, he right got there. Bishop was, oh, he is down on the floor after taking that shot. And there's a lot of time left in the round. Get up. Andre Bishop back up, but is he back in gotcha. the fight? I think it could still be dangerous. A wounded animal is always something gotcha. you have to be cautious with. Gotcha. And right now, Andre Bishop can be dangerous, can catch his opponent, maybe coming in a little reckless. Oh, that's good Man. stuff. Fire Got him. Back with one of his get own. off me. No, get off Andre me. Andre Bishop crashes home with the uppercut. And this round... Can't get up, Craig. He just ain't <laughs> even watching this fight. I can see it in their eyes. McQueen fucked us. We're not winning any decisions tonight. Means you gotta knock this guy on the canvas. Understand? Knock him on his ass. Okay. Okay. Got you. Bishops gets a chance at redemption here with a fresh round, but Teddy, I'm Got always him. concerned Got about him. how a fighter looks after he's been knocked down in the last Got round. Him. Oh, things opened up, and he was able to play the right Get off me. Well. Get off me. Get off me. Stop cheating. Get off me. Bruh. Got him. Got him. favorite punches and it works that time for him one of the fastest punches in the game you see how he just turns over that hook got him right to got the him. head with that right targeting a left hand down low bishop's doing got him. exactly what you Damn. should to be a strong defensive fighter you got to block those punches away Shake it off. He comes over the top with that right hand, a real solid shot. Got him. Andre Got him. now in a spot get off me. that many fighters have gone to extremes to try to get out of. We've seen guys foul, illegal fouls on purpose just to remedy Got situations him. like this. Got him. Oh. Gets him with oh. the right hand. Bishop is Damn. Oh, Bishop took some big shot. Right. Goings here of this round, and he goes down. And he survives. <sighs> I'm up. Get I'm up. Bruh. I but I was on the green. One mistake can change a career. Oh How my will God. Andre Bishop get back after this? He loses by knockout to Ricardo. Facts, don't forget to like the stream, y'all. Listen, y'all. We back, we back. I'm gonna take a little break. Whoever got boxing, y'all, get boxing, y'all. Let's ball up. I'm down to whip some of y'all out, man. I'm back on in a bit through all the fame bills. Y'all never know what I'm going to do next. Might play a little big planet. You never really know. Let's get it. Let's do what we do, man. Easy.